Hello and welcome back to another Python 3.7 tutorial. My name's Tom with Massacred Online. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. In today's tutorial, we're going to take a look at the sort list method. Similar to the sorted built-in function, but the sort list method um, actually returns a modified list of the actual object we're calling it on, where the sorted built-in function returns a new list. That is the only difference between the two. Oh, and by the way, the sorted built-in functions a bit more efficient according to Python. I haven't tested it. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the sort list method. All right, um, basically, let's start with a list, obviously, since it's a list method. So one, oh, we're going to go with four, three, two, and one for our list. And we're going to go ahead and say a dot sort. So if we don't pass any arguments we're going to go ahead and you notice we weren't returned anything when we use sort it we're returned a new list call a and we got one two three and four so if we did the same thing on um let's go ahead and reset that if we did uh sort it like this a and there you go see how we returned a list so that's another difference between the two um and the reason it returns it to because it's a new list uh, well, let's see. Let's take a look at another example here. Let's go ahead and look at the reverse keyword argument for the sorted method. So we'll go ahead. And this is just like the or the sort method. It's just like the sorted building uh, function, and that's just like confusing the heck out of me. A is square brackets dog, and we'll do cat horse, of course. And we'll do a monkey. Always wanted a monkey and an ape. All right, so there we go. We got our animals. Um, we're gonna say, hey, a dot sort, and we'll say reverse that for me. So we'll say reverse is equal to true because default it's reverse is equal to false. Hit return, and then we call our list, and we got monkey, horse, dog, cat, and ape. So it's in reverse alphabetical order. Now, let's take out take a look at one more um, scenario here. Um, basically, with using strings, capitalize and uh, capitalize animals, capitalized strings will come before uh, lowercase strings. So we're going to look at how we work around that. So a is equal to a list of animals again. This time we're going to do uh, some uppercase, lowercase. I know you guys are getting sick of seeing these animals, but hey, it's the easiest for me to do. So horse and monkey and um, let's do ape lowercase. I like that. All right. And something like that. So we'll do a dot sort to see what happens with the uppercase and lowercase. Call A, we got cat, horse, monkey, and then we got ape, dog, all right? Uh, but I want to sort all these in all in order. It didn't matter if they have uppercase, lowercase, and whatnot. So the way we fix that is we're going to say A dot sort, and we're going to call the key, the key keyword argument. That's a little difficult to say. The key keyword argument. And we're going to pass a str for string, a lower method on that. And we're going to go ahead and, yeah, that's all I need to do. Call A, ape, cat, dog, horse, monkey. Now it's all in alphabetical order, no matter if it has uppercase, lowercase, or no case at all. So if you have any questions, please let me know over at mastercode.online. Otherwise, I will see you in the next tutorial. Have a good night.